Good morning, beloved. Uh, this morning we have some information for all of you for our congregation related to uh, when we start back in-person worship. We have been in conversation with our bishop uh, who has a task group that's working on guidelines and procedures for uh, gathering back again uh, at a designated date. And so in the conversation with the bishop and pastors across our area, we've received guidance that uh, we should aim for starting back in-person worship at some point after June the 15th. So based on that guidance, uh, we are making plans now to restart worship in person uh, on June the 21st. This is a little bit different than what we had first announced, but I think it's important to know, we've said this a number of times, this is not something done out of a spirit of fear, but something that we continue to do and work through out of an abundance of caution for and concern for our congregation and our community. In fact, I think we see it as a way of sharing love for our neighbors and being careful, especially during this time. Um, so please know that we're praying for you and that we love you very much. And please be on the lookout for some more information about some policies and procedures that we'll have in place when we do start back on the 21st. So we as a, a staff are working hard to formulate those policies and procedures, practices that will keep all of us safe. Uh, so we'll be watching this week and beyond for uh, that information. It'll come out in the newsletter and by uh, YouTube announcements and various ways, maybe on social media. So we'll continue to um, communicate with you about what worship will look like when we gather. So just a word about that, it's going to be very, very different. And it's not really what any of us might hope it would be, but our utmost concern is uh, our safety, our well-being, our health and well-being. So for instance, when we communicate um, these procedures, at the top of the list will be, um, we're going to have to calculate, which we're in the process of doing, what is the capacity for each of our worship services. So already based on that, we will offer three worship services, uh, two in the sanctuary, main sanctuary, and one at Wesley Chapel. They'll be held at 8.30, 9.45, and, uh, and 10.55. Uh, we will be sending you information and contacts requesting an RSVP. That helps us to plan and look at capacity and how people, what your preference is when you would like to gather and helps us manage our entire congregation as we begin to gather again in person for worship. So I hope that you'll be patient with us and be cooperative as we try to manage uh, ramping back into life gathering together uh, again. The second thing I would mention today is yes, we will be wearing masks there will be hand sanitizer, there will be social spacing, and so all of those details uh, will be in the guidelines. So June the 21st is our target date. Uh, we're still in a very uh, fluid situation, but that is our target date. That's our intention of when we will start in-person worship again. So please be watching for communication this week and opportunities to express your preference of a worship time, and together we will work toward rebuilding uh, our gathering opportunities in worship and beyond that as we move through this year. Uh, by August the 1st, prior to that and the starting of school, we'll reevaluate where we are. Uh, we will make suggestions and plans, formulate plans uh, for restarting some type of fall schedule, but again, uh, it's going to be very different. So we're managing this. We ask for your prayers and your support that we encourage one another. And together, uh, we look forward to any way that we can be connected to one another in Christ and be supportive of one another and gradually build back our life of shared worship and fellowship together. Uh, this is not gonna be a short journey. It's not a sprint, it's a marathon. So we'll share more information with you as we move along, 
but just wanted to give you that date today, June the 21st, and we look forward to seeing you in person, in worship, uh, beginning that day. So blessings and prayers, and look for further details as we move along. Thank you for your time, and we really are looking forward to seeing you very soon. Very much. Thanks.